And what we did here is we uh, developed this process with a rotating axis and a frame and the robot places the fibers on this rotating uh, frame without any molds and also without any cutoffs. So only as many fibers as are placed ideally as you need to carry the loads. Here you can see it. We have here on top these two frames that can easily, easily be adapted to different geometric configurations. Then we place here the uh, glass fiber body, the hyperbolic glass fiber body. Glass fibers are cheap, but weak. And then in the next subsequent step, we place black carbon fibers adapted to the loading of the components. These uh, fibers are resin soaked. And then we put the entire package in an oven, cure it for several hours. And what you get here is a composite structure that is um, able to carry high forces without a mold, without cut off of fiber mats, only as many fibers placed as you need to carry the loads.